What's going on, Free Code Camp, and whoever else? Um, this is video or video series number two, going through some of the uh, curriculum of Free Code Camp, uh, specifically the projects. Uh, this is one of the take-home projects from the bottom of the curriculum. Um, it's uh, I hadn't seen something like this before. It's a light bright app. Um, so we got a bunch of user stories here, um, but the best thing to do is just show you. I called it night light or something for some reason, night lights. But uh, we basically have a grid here with a bunch of circles in this case, and you click on one and you get uh, it can get it to light up. And it, when it lights up, it's going to give you a different color every time. Um, you can hold the mouse down and drag it around. And you're going to get a color like that. Do it again. Um, each time you click on it, it's going to give you a different, totally different color. Totally random. And if you double click, it clears it. Um, you've got a reset all button that clears the whole board, and then a reset button, which just clears the last move. So that is the app. Pretty. Uh, pretty basic I guess but it's got some it's got some tricky parts to it and uh, we build it in this tutorial I built it using react just on CodePen, and we're gonna go through and build the whole entire app um, in a series of probably four or five six videos something like that so we'll get started go to CodePen. Uh, I've got a template that's my react template it just saves me having to load in uh, it saves me having to load in a couple of the uh, I gotta save it first. Uh, we'll call it what is it? Light bright. Call it light bright. Get our live view open over on another page. And yeah, I just put in the basic boilerplate for React. Um, it's nothing that you can't do in a couple minutes, but it saves it saves me, you know, five minutes of setting it up, I guess. And we'll ditch these semicolons. Say no to semicolons. In React or in JavaScript, period, really. Um, there's a little bit of styling, and we won't focus too much on the styling. Um, but we'll make a root, uh, root div. And inside root. Have our controls. That's the, just the top, the title bar, basically. You can separate that out into a, a functional component if you want, but I'm not for this one. Uh, light by Our title, our div, our buttons inside of here, okay, get, I like getting, getting the, uh, get the skeleton of the app up first.
get some of the HTML or the little JSX and the, uh, the JSX and the uh, CSS out of the way. All this. White array. Okay. So off to a pretty good start. And one of one of the big things is like how are we gonna get these random colors? How are we gonna get uh, all these different lights or whatever? So what React is pretty cool about is uh, you can create a ton of components really quickly uh, using React. Um, so I guess the best way we'll start with we'll start with a little bit of our CSS. Well, SCSS in this case, but I'm just going to write it as regular CSS. So our root is our main our main window, and just to make things easy, we'll use uh, view height. Or, uh, yeah, view height and view width, which is just the window, basically the viewport, viewport height and viewport width. Um, it's an easy way to make an app stay on one screen, basically, you know, just Nice, condensed, simple, don't have to scroll around, nothing overflows. started so okay and our light array is basically the board so these are going to be 10 minute chunk videos just because I'm using free screencasting software so at some point I'll wrap a video up and then we'll just jump right into the next 10 minutes uh, so light array Mid size for light array. Let's start with 90 DHC. Make the top bar 10 and then this 90 just that takes up the whole entire screen. Just like that. A little bit bigger than the screen. That's all good. Um, and then we're going to make this. This also flex. And we'll make it a flex. we we'll flex direction to make it a column. Kind of, kind of blast through a lot of the CSS quickly, but if you're new to CSS, uh, this is pretty good. We're just aligning everything. Um, so basically, we do line items here. That will center that that grid for us, like so. So that's a pretty good start. We got the basic skeleton of our Light Bright app, and. And next, we'll work on building the individual cells in the next video.